Welcome back to Freedom Planet. We're fighting a boss. Oh, wait, no, not quite yet. Never mind. That's a little later on. That door was uh, misleading. Oh, is this? No, it's not. Never mind. This is another puzzle area. I have to go hit two more buttons. And this is another mini boss with a mechanic that you can use to make it destroy itself. It will peck wherever you're standing, and then you can peck itself, and it will destroy itself. Well, if you can. Come on. Hit me! Ha! That's funny. There's, there's dialogue for that. Didn't know that. And there is an achievement for destroying it that way. As I found out last night when I played this for the first time. Eventually we'll get to the parts I haven't played yet. Like this was the last level I played. So after this will be a new territory. And I won't be able to say like, oh, I did this part already. So there's spikes going down there. Nothing to worry about. I'm already above them. Right? Right. Nothing to worry about. I'm just going to charge up this crystal here. And okay, the spikes are coming back up. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen though. It's just a matter of outrunning a wall of advancing death. Which I completely failed to do the first time I played, I might add. Nailed it this time though, because I knew what I was doing. Uh, this way. Health, health. Ow! I did not pick up health just to lose it again. Screw you! Now it's boss time. Spade? You mean another Sonic OC? So? I needed to find my father's killer. Not like a couple traitors like yourselves would care. Rather be called a traitor than a murderer. He kind of looks like a recolored Amy Sprite. Scarf left us no choice. And you've left me no choice. And you've left me no choice. <laughs> Still training, I see. You want to fight? Come and get it. I'd love to stay and dance, but Mayor Zhao's got a tight schedule. Besides, if something else is guarding this thing, I'd hate to be around when it wakes up. You're insane, you know that? You're never going to get away with it. <laughs> yeah. We'll see about that. You'll never get away with it. No, oh, I already have. Eh. Never make what we Let's fight a boss. Oh, okay. It's a T-Rex Robo Mantis. Break its arms. Okay, without. Okay. Wow. This was a lot easier the first time. So I need to not be where he lands. Ow. Okay. That part about not being where he lands applies to the arms as well. Whoa, too much dash. Hey, get back here. Okay, I swear I did not do this badly against him the first time. I beat him on my first try. Well, and I just died. Okay. How far back am I? Am I gonna have to watch the cutscene again? Because that's gonna be annoying. Pick up all the health. Oh, really? Come on. Okay. Oh, okay, good. It's not going to make me watch the whole cutscene again. That's nice. Don't be standing there. Okay, let's do this the smart way. Broke his arms. Punch him in the face and run. Whoa, okay. Broke his arm. Take a claw to the face. And punch him in the face. Okay. Doing much better this time. This is more like how it went the first time. Because you can pretty much destroy one of his arms while he's in that roar animation. So it... 
kind of speeds things along a little bit. Broke his eye. Ow. Got it. And I'm close to dying. Come on. Oh, this is going to be close if I can do it. Oh, God. Break his arm, break his arm, break his arm. Oh, crap. <sighs> okay. Okay, you go away. You go away. Get the health back. Yeah. And take three. Okay. He's gonna land right there and punch, 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 punch. Got it. And run and huh. Okay. This is how you do it. This is how you do Okay, don't be where he's landing. God! Stop it! Okay. Need to do this a little smarter. Okay. Well, and then he does the angle attack, of course. But the minute I start deciding to be smart, so does he. Oh, come on. Maybe I can do this this time. Maybe I'll take one more try. Really? What is he? Come on. No. Stop the range attacks, really? That's annoying. Okay. Got this. I can jump around too. What? Okay. Come on. Stop it. Come on. One more hit. Yeah, there we go. That was a bit more annoying than it was the first time. <sighs> that is how it's done. I'm pretty sure I just said that. When I died the first time. Or the second time. One of those times when I died. Oh, there was an achievement for that one too. So I guess for when you run into mini bosses that have a puzzle mechanic to insta kill them, there's an achievement for each one. So I just got that one for the uh Pushing the block onto the first one. Hello! I'm over here. You made it out. You're no here. duh. It's just a scratch. I'm fine. Tis but a scratch. Well, we better find Torque and get home so I can patch it up. Well, this stinks. How are we gonna get more money? We'll think of something. What I really want to know is why Spade is working for Mayor Zhao. Mm, but loads of cash. Well, Zhao might know something about the assassination. But that still doesn't explain what he needs the stone for. I have a bad feeling about all this. <clears throat> Someone's following us. What do you mean? <laughs> Wait. Someone with a shield pulled me out of the cave. It must have been her. <laughs> sorry about bouncing on you. Hello? I'm sorry? Don't be scared. I promise we'll keep you safe. Are you a dragon? Yeah. Then, can I touch your hair? What? Huh? <laughs> oh, oh, never mind. No, no, it's okay. I was just surprised is all. I won't hurt you. <laughs> it's like a rope. <laughs> yeah. 
I love sure. the cutscene animations they do sometimes. It's just a fun little touch. Lila, that's a pretty name. <laughs> thanks. This is my friend Carol. So thanks for saving me back there. Well, what are you doing all the way out here? I was playing over here, and then those people came. They're not very nice. I don't think. You know what? You can come to our secret hideout. What? Oh, really? Yeah. Nobody knows where it is except us. That sounds like fun! The Kingdom Stone has been taken! Your Excellency! By who? Mayor Zhao. His pilgrimage to the temple was a cover-up! This is troubling. Zhao may be a buffoon. But I never believed he was capable of this. This guy has the most badass voice. A pair of youngsters warned us about the attack. I refuse to listen. I have failed you, Magister. Don't be hard on yourself, General. I would have been just as skeptical. And tell me, who was it that issued this warning? Something <laughs> doesn't smell right. Well, sorry! You never smell right. I'm referring to those kids. They know something about this. We have to find them. <laughs> I don't know why, but that that random quack is just funny. You sure you don't want to hang out with us? Thanks, but I have a lot of work to do. I'm gonna try and fix my gadgets. Fair enough. Just shout if you need anything. All right. What are you gonna be up to? Oh, we should have plenty of things to do, especially with a new girl around. Plenty of things to do. Uh huh. Plenty of things to do. I'm bored. How about a movie? Oh, yeah, yeah. That that. No, no. That that that's totally exactly what what I, what I thought you meant by. Never mind. Sure. Uh, why not? What kind of movies do you like, Mila? I like being surprised. All right, I think I have just the thing. Moving on. Not like a couple traitors like yourselves would care. Down. What is it? Tort turned into an alien or something. What? What? <laughs> Come with me. Come on. I'm <laughs> probably had a bad dream. I'm serious. Get up. Come on. Get up. Get up. All right. Let me get my shoes on. Plot advancement time. Another world. Actually, I'm part of an alliance between many different worlds. We're called Chasers. Uh huh. So you're an alien then? Uh huh. Pretty much, yeah. Uh huh. Hey, Scooties. <laughs> uh huh. You don't believe me. Actually, I do. Really? They say that a long time ago, dragons came to Avalis and mixed with our ancestors. And not just ones like Lilac, huge ones like in the movie. So, how does that work? work Never mind. So I guess it's not much of a stretch for other things to be out there too. I imagine there was quite a bit of stretching going on. I see. So, why do a bunch of aliens care about our planet? The man that wants your kingdom stone isn't from around here either. He calls himself Lord Brevin. Lord? Well, he didn't get that name selling cookies. He's dangerous with a capital D. Nice to know all the planets of the galaxy use the same alphabet, too. Hundreds of worlds destroyed. 
thousands of heroes killed or corrupted. Enormous amounts of weapon energy stolen. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. According to our scans, the Kingdom Stone has enough energy to double the size of his army. Well, we can't have that. Guess it. It'd be unstoppable. Sounds like he was already unstoppable. I'll try and convince your leaders of his existence, but if I can't get them to help me, if Brevin gets his hands on the Kingdom Stone, then I'll have no choice. I'll have to destroy it. Destroy it? You can't be serious! I'll only destroy it if I have no other choice. I swore to my captain on his dying breath that I would not let Brevin get that stone. I'm sorry about your captain, but you can't destroy it. In fact, you won't even have to think about it, because I'm going to help you get it back. I don't care how dangerous it is. It's going to take a Oh, then the music kicks in. If she's going to go for it, then I am Oops. too. I think I skipped some dialogue. If we can meet up a giant praying mantis thing together, then who knows what else we can do. I want to too. I guess we could let you save Carol's life a few more times. Hey. Yay. Yay. So three of you are really going to help me stop him. Say no more, Team Lilac's got you. This is the longest dang cutscene. I'd be lying if I said I was comfortable with this, but I honestly could use your help. You all know this world better than I do. So, it's official, right? <laughs> More or less. Welcome aboard, ladies. Yeah, awesome. Wonderful. Pose. Just remember something really important. Don't talk about our mission unless I say so. We do not want the whole world thinking we're crazy. Understood. Yeah. I don't know about you guys, but I'm exhausted. Yeah, we better get some shut eye. We've got a big day ahead of us. Lilac. Okay. This cutscene goes on a bit longer, so I'm going to end things here, and we'll pick up in the next episode. I will see you then.